This is KCCI News Channel 8 at 6 in HD with Kevin Cooney, Stacy Horst, Chief Meteorologist John McLaughlin, and Sports Director Andy Garman. We're proud to be Iowa's news leader. 30-year-old Des Moines woman is continuing her recovery from a horrible accident that happened slightly more than a year ago. Christina Keeker suffered severe head injuries when she was hit by a car driven by an 85-year-old Windsor Heights man. It happened in September of 2011. But as News Channel 8's Mark Tauschek shows us, more than a year later, Keeker is making steady improvement. Left. Okay, right. Two months after the accident. Left. Okay, right. Christina Keeker could not stand, and only noises spilled out of her mouth. Doctors told her husband Christopher to hope for a breakthrough that might never come. Perfect. Ready? But 13 months after her accident... And this is part of Christina developing and progressing. She's going to walk on her own two feet someday. That's the goal, metaphorically and physically. It's safe to say a breakthrough has been made. Christina can now stand and take small, careful steps by herself, but her true freedom is on a bike. You feel safe? Mm-hmm. Yeah. As long as you feel safe, that's great. This is the result of countless hours of therapy and the unwavering support of her husband, who is with her all day, every day. I committed to Christina when I married her to do whatever it took, no matter what, for whatever reason, to maintain our relationship in the way it was and maintain the integrity of our values and our beliefs. And that's what got me through the worst moments. Her newfound freedom came courtesy of a Michigan company, Tara Trike, who donated a $1,000 bike after learning Christopher wanted to buy one from Bar Bike in Clive. Tara Trike just called me and said, hey, we want to give away a, a Rover to your customer. Is that OK? Uh, I said, that's fantastic. How do you feel? Good. Wonderful. Let's take it to the right. There's a long way to go before Christina is even close to what used to be normal, but she can bike. This is very therapeutic. This is the most therapeutic thing in our life. And tell you all about it. It's good to have the exercise to use all my muscles. And it's good to see people in the scenery. And that's enough for now. Recently, when I wake up next to a person that can talk back to me, that really gives me more strength to keep keep up the fight. Without Christina's help, I would fall apart. How do you feel? Good. Wonderful. Mark Tosha, KCCI News Channel 8, Iowa's news leader. The 85-year-old driver who hit Christina Keeker pleaded guilty last year to failing to yield on a left turn. And by the way, according to the Brain Injury Alliance of Iowa, every year over 2,000 Iowans are hospitalized with a traumatic brain injury.